I'm Andrea Fraresi, Design Director of the Centro Stile Ducati. I'm Mitya Borgert, Head of Design of Automobili Lamborghini. This is the second episode of the collaboration between uh, Ducati and Lamborghini. Uh, we started uh, two years ago uh, with the Diavel 1260 Lamborghini, inspired by the Cian, the Lamborghini Cian, and it was a huge success. The bike uh, has been sold out in a uh, few weeks, and so we decided to have this uh, second step, second episode, and now the inspiration comes from the Huracan STO and the motorcycle is the Street Fighter V4. We at Lamborghini, we always take inspiration from our friends of Ducati, so you can spot a lot of details uh, from the motorcycle world. I love motorcycles, I ride also Ducati, so it's for us a pleasure to work with the design team and in general with the team of Ducati. And also this time we have followed the same, the same method that, that uh, we have proven it works. We have brought our motorcycle here and together with Mitya and uh, his uh, guys, we have started walking around the, the car uh, finding how to take inspiration, which part uh, has been the, the right one to take inspiration to build up the, the, the new part for the motorcycle. Usually all the projects are starting that we are together taking a look uh, at the design DNA of the specific brand. So in the terms of Lamborghini, for sure, it's about, in general, the silhouette. Of course, the STO, the Huracan STO, has a silhouette that is inspired from a race car. So there's an air scoop, there's a fin, there's a wing on the rear. But in general, it's taking the design DNA of Lamborghini, especially when you see uh, the car in front view with the strong inclination of the side windows. It's a typical Lamborghini, but you can see immediately that this car is taking 100% uh, inspiration from the race cars. The Street Fighter uh, V4 is uh, the, basically a naked Panigale, a strip Panigale. Panigale is our uh, racing motorcycle. That's why we, uh, we thought that uh, the Huracan being a, a pure racing car would have been the right, uh, the right car to take inspiration for this product. Within the Huracan range, the Huracan STO is also the most lightweight uh, version of the Huracan. It's the car uh, that you can take, of course, uh, on a normal street, but you can especially enjoy it uh, during a beautiful track day. And that's why this car is designed like this. So when you look at all the details, um, everything is designed uh, with the, what we call the Kofango, the big clamshell uh, front hood. Everything is designed using carbon fiber uh, on an existing Huracan. So it's the most lightweight, the most performant, the most downforce and the most fun to drive version of the Huracan. Also the Street Fighter, uh, being a, a, a naked motorcycle, so not the motorcycle that you use typically on the racetrack. The Street Fighter can be used uh, properly on the racetrack and if you look some videos of our tester, Alessandro Valia on the racetrack, it, it, it's amazing. We said that because uh, the bike has also the aero package, the same aero package of the Panigale because the acceleration of this motorcycle is so impressive that you need this uh, aero pack, this downforce uh, to keep the wheel on the, on the tarmac. The Huracan STO is then also using so much carbon fiber, so you see all these little details. We have special wheels that are designed to look really lightweight, to, uh, to be really lightweight and to have a center lock uh, fixation. On top of that, Lamborghini is famous for colors, for rich colors. So we are offering more than 400 really strong colors in our uh, color portfolio. So out of these colors, we have chosen a very cool uh, color combination for the Huracan STO. It is called Verde Chitrea, and we're using a contrast color uh, that is called Arancho Duck. It's a very strong and a very rich uh, orange color that is tending to be almost like a red. A really cool color combination. And we thought it's a perfect inspiration also for a motorcycle. We have a kind of a funny story about the, this color combination because uh, our CEO, Claudio Domenicali, one day uh, coming back from a business trip, uh, arrived in Bologna airport and he shot the, a picture of uh, the Huracan STO and sent me the picture and the, 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 the comment on the WhatsApp was, this a, could be a perfect color for, uh, for a future motorcycle. And it was exactly this combination, the Verde Citrea and the Arancio Duck. And so me and Mita decided that uh, this should have been the, the right color, the perfect color for this, uh, for this motorcycle. Mita, let's have a deeper look to the motorcycle, especially to the parts, the pieces that we have designed, newly designed, especially for this First motorcycle. of all, this is fantastic. It's Thank a you. fantastic result. I mean, really my heart is opening. 
Yes, thank you. I'm, I'm very happy also about the, the, the final result. So let's start. Let's start from the front fender that clearly has been inspired by the cofango of your car. Yes, I see clearly the hexagon here, the power domes that we have also in the car, super. And also, if you, of course, you have, all, uh, you have noticed immediately that the texture of the carbon fiber is the same as, uh, as the one on the car. It's so precious, no? also here, uh, the wing underneath the front light is in carbon fiber. It's yes, really it nice, really nice. It's even the, yeah, a very, let's say, self-secure look of the motorcycle. This is, our, this is our sign, the Ducati sign, so the hair bro. The second part are the, the, the hard, so the, the cover. Uh, around the, the um, water radiator inspired by the, the front fender of the car. Very nice. And the, those wings, they give a lot of downforce, I guess. Yes, uh, they are extremely useful when you uh, ride the motorcycle on the racetrack, when you exit from the corner. The wings help you to prevent the too much wheelie of the, of the motorcycle and so you can accelerate quite hard. Super cool. I see here the Y shape. Yes, uh -huh. of course, coming from yeah. also from Lamborghini. The seat, uh, Alcantara leather with this touch of, uh, of red and uh, Arancio duck. The tail section is also new and it takes inspiration from the bonnet of yes. the car. What is really cool is also it's exactly the look that is inspiring me, you know, when yeah. you know on our cars to see the rear tire, this, to see the rear wheel, and then always the lights are kind of, uh, you know, hidden. Uh, underneath uh, such a fairing, it's super cool. Here's also the air outlets uh, with carbon fiber, very nice. I love, really love this uh, detail, so the Italian flag uh, in between, the, on the party line between the, the uh, Arancio duct and the Verde Citrea, so it's a very, very nice detail, uh, I like it a lot. Here's also something nice with the exhaust pipe done, no? Yes, the muffler is a, a titanium, it's a Krapovich titanium, which give a racing touch to the motorcycle. Then also here, STO is written, carbon fiber. Also here, this little wing is super cool. Yes, it's, this is clearly inspired by the air vent of the car for the rear brake. Very nice. The 63, then yes. also really nice painted here with this extra yes. uh, black line to give more contrast, very nice. Of course, the 63 is your magic number and so can't be missed on every motorcycle inspired by Lamborghini. And last but not least, the rear wheel. Yes, wow. So the rim is exactly the same uh, of the car. So it's, uh, and of course, having this, the, the single sided swinging arm, the rim is completely exposed. Ah, this is really well done no? because it's all—it's really the design of the STO, and it's unbelievable to see this on a motorcycle. Yes, and it's so thin. I, I, when I when I um, have seen for the first time the uh, the rim, the rapid prototype of the rim, I was so impressed about the thickness of the of the spokes, which is very very thin, and the nut. The nut is exactly your nut. Uh, so this is—I I like a lot this. Uh, this uh, red touch together with the red touch of the of the caliper. I like this little detail here that reminds me of the MotoGP. Yes, exactly, exactly. As, as we have said, this is the naked version of a racing motorcycle. This is unbelievable, beautiful here. Also the protection of the exhaust pipe with the carbon fiber. Yeah, I, I like a lot this uh, combination of carbon fiber and uh, aluminum uh, anodized. And also I like a lot the, the red touch of the front caliper. Andrea, this motorcycle is so beautiful. Thank Congratulations you. to you and the team. Thank you. Uh, really a fantastic job what you did and um, I think it will not stay the last one. Yeah, I'm sure, I'm sure. I think that once again we have done, we have realized a, a fantastic product and it will be sold out immediately. For sure, for sure. I cannot wait for the next one. It's really beautiful. Me too. Congratulations. Me too. Okay, thank you. Thank you again. Thank Ciao. You.